What is up guys, tonight is Friday, July 29th, 2022. I'm gonna go to the National tomorrow and this came in today, so I decided to do a last minute rip. This is a hobby box of the all new 2021 slash 22 Topps Chrome Bundesliga Soccer. Uh, this year, albeit a lot cheaper than last year and the year before. Um, last year's boxes came out at around $300 and um, you know, it's the same format, 18 cards or 18 packs per box, four cards per pack and one guaranteed autograph per box. Uh, this year's print run is significantly higher with almost 3,000 or about 3,000 um, numbered cards of each base card uh, from the 100 card base set. And then autographs also have up to over 1,000 parallels as well. Numbered parallels, of course. Um, so, yeah. This year we have autos out of 299, base out of 399. Actually, two base parallels out of 399. Um, and uh, there is a three card short print set that is out of 300, the trophies and ball. Um, that is a three card addition to the base and a 78 card base auto checklist and three insert auto sets, all numbered to hundred or less, um, 27 total subjects across all three sets. And of course the same three inserts as well, which I don't think they have parallels for them. So that's interesting. Um, I picked this up for 95. I figured, you know, I told people not to really get it, but, um, for product review, it can't really hurt too, too much. Um, unless we get absolutely skunked and, um, well, the one good thing is that we're almost back to 2017, 18 prices because the uh, prices on these hobby boxes have actually fallen to about $80 now or even 79 free ship on eBay. And it's only been released for three days. So we're going to take all the packs out. And uh, there's also a light format, by the way. So this product is hobby and light and the light boxes have five refractors and four rate waves, um, which are exclusive to light boxes. And light has become a pretty common theme now for the for the last year. So a lot of you guys are familiar with it. So here's the pack design, here's the front. Um, definitely feels a bit more low end, I guess. Um, so yeah, magentas and magenta waves, one in 49, geez. So one in 49 for a out of 399 parallel. Um, that's one way to do it. Anyways, new product, fresh set. Um, the design looks pretty good. Almost gives me like finest vibes, but not really. Definitely uh, different from previous years of Chrome. So we start off with Yasuo Kimmich. We have a rookie of Fakir. Sydney Rybiger rookie for Leipzig. That's a good way to start it. And we have Anton Sock rookie. So that's a base uh, base pack right there. Based on uh, Soccer Cards HQ's calculations on the print run, um, we're looking at, on average, 2.6 numbered cards per box. Um, and then, of course, the autograph. And a lot of the autos are going to be numbered. Verts, Llewellyn. We have a refractor here, I think. Riemann. And a Jude Bellium refractor. We'll take that. The, um, the stock on the cards actually feels... Um, lower quality not as uh, not as thick not as firm as previous years so i would say this almost feels like a like elevated match attacks chrome set um just minus the match attack stats and uh less numbered cards even because sono but i can't judge it too hard since uh we don't know what it has to offer yet Bayez, or at least this box bloom and zaber schlager refractor like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, these sets, uh, like, these cards almost feel like they're, um, like, they're, like, they've been sitting in, like, a moist environment. It's a, it's a weird softness to them. Lubicic, uh, Neuhaus, Ortega, and we have, what is this? Is this a pink or something? Definitely not a red. Makoto Hasebe for Eintracht Frankfurt. Oh, this is the magenta, right? So this is the base magenta, not the magenta wave, 75 of 399. You could call that a near color match. So that's our first numbered card, Hasebe Magenta, numbered out of 399. Most definitely not sh not super short printed. Uh, I'll do a separate stack for our numbered slash auto. Definitely looking forward to the autograph though, because it is a pretty large checklist name, but it'd be kind of cool to get an insert auto. Malin, Avumpa, uh, Vranx, and Golden Generation insert for Emmanuel Riemann. That's the insert look for you guys. I do like that, the golden generation. It's a quite, it's, it's pretty clean. I'll have to give it that. Again, the uh, cardstock just is setting me off for some reason. Just feels a lot uh, lower end. Musiala. Musiala's on the checklist, by the way, for the autos. Pepe, and so is Lewandowski, and uh, Holland as well. Uh, Maolita, and another golden generation. This time, Makoto Hasebe, of the same guy that we just pulled a numbered magenta of. So I can't really imagine that um, Lindstrom, that the uh, that the resale on the parallels will be too valuable in this set, especially given how much was produced. Andre Silva, Niakate, and we have a Florian Kainz refractor. Don't know that guy. For Cologne. 
I think that might be your autograph here. I think that might be your autograph. Not sure. Erling Holland. Angelo Stiller, rookie. Max Cruz and Nicholas Dorsch. I think that's just a base auto there. Uh, yeah, so I can't, I can't also imagine what these are out of because the autographs have parallels as well. And I have the checklist in front of me, so I'll read that out. Um, the autograph parallels, you have base autos, but then you also have blue out of 299, purple out of 199, uh, ray waves, which are light exclusive out of 100, prisms out of 175, magenta 150, green 99, pink wave 75, gold 50, orange 25, red 10, and super factor one of ones. And we got a base auto. So can't say we did the best there. I mean, if you're opening a box of this, you'd prefer at least to get a numbered auto, if anything. But um, that's not to say that we can't get some nice numbered cards still uh, from the rest of the packs. Vincenzo Grifo, Makoto Hasebe, another one of him, uh, Simicon and Predal. So, I mean, if the hobby boxes drop, like, really, really low, you could probably get a case of this stuff and just go for 12 autos and uh, maybe a couple dozen numbered cards and... Uh, do pretty well on that, at least. Refractor for Angelo Stiller. That's a rookie for a TSG Hoffenheim. So if you guys have uh, ripped any of this product or seen it around, feel free to let me know what your thoughts on it. Um, there's definitely some good cards to be pulled. And the designs, I'd give it like a 7.5 out of 10. Schlager. And we have, I think this looks like an Aqua of Jan Thielman. This one's going to be numbered 34 of 275. And uh, the 275 is going to be Aqua, I believe. So that's that's a nice looking uh, nice looking parallel. Again, very very high numbered as well. Out of 275034, the splashing is from my turtles in the background. Maybe one day I'll do a turtle review, not review reveal. But uh, until then, maybe not. Joe Reyna, Baumgartner. Timo Horn and a refractor of Caligari for Augsburg. And we're getting down to our last few packs. Hopefully we can pull a third number card to at least beat the odds on that. Pamacano, Dorsch, Toussart, and Heroes of Tomorrow, rookie Lasse Gunther. Uh, I pulled an autograph of his from a stadium club from. I'd say at the same price, this or Stadium Club, it's hard to say. Stadium Club definitely has a shorter print, and um, I'd say it looks nicer because of the photography. Oh, we got a pink wave here, a magenta wave. But um, I don't know. This is more flagship, so it's hard to say. Alan E. And for Armenia, Bielfeld, Brian Lasme, rookie. Oh, this is actually not a magenta. See, it's hard to tell between this, but this is actually a pink wave numbered out of 75. So pinks are out of 75, pink waves are also out of 75, and magenta is out of 399, and magenta waves are also out of 399. So again, if you guys uh, are a bit confused, just go on Cardboard Connection and check out the checklist, and you guys will see all the parallels. We did get a rookie parallel, so I will, you know, I'll take that. You got three numbered cards so far. Um, and you know, adding any more wouldn't possibly hurt, but again, for what is almost $100 uh, for a hobby box, most definitely a risk. Sirdar, and here's a tomorrow of Paul Jackal, or Jackal. I'll just, I'll sleeve up these uh, inserts just because they look really, really good. And the Heroes of Tomorrow, I'm assuming, is because it's like a future stars, but just worded differently. So there are going to be a lot of rookies. Um, Lasse Gunter was like born in like January of 2003. So definitely not a veteran uh, set at all. Pry this pack open. We have Oddly Rookie, Pantovich, Sobosly, and Zentner. Two packs left, and I will do a quick little recap and then give my final thoughts, and then hopefully you guys can leave some of your thoughts in the comments too. And if you made it this far in the video, feel free to give me a like and subscribe if you guys enjoy this content. Um, I'll be doing more, and of course I'll be at the National tomorrow, so maybe I'll do like a mini kind of vlog. I don't know if I'm going to do a full out, like all out vlog, but Lindstrom. A rookie uh, refractor there, but uh, definitely going to want to capture some of the moments and memories uh, from the Nationals. So I'll be there tomorrow. Tomorrow the show is I think from 12 to 6, and then Sunday is a shorter show since it's the last day, Mayor Hoffer. But uh, I'll try to be there for the most of the day as well. And Tehran and Heroes of Tomorrow of Armel Bella Kochap. 
So um, I don't think these inserts from Bundesliga Chrome this year have parallels. I'm just gonna check on the back of the pack quickly. As you guys can see, they have autographs, but they don't, so they just have the base autographs, yeah. So they will have an insert, which is the regular one, and then the autograph version, but there's no parallels for the base insert or the autograph version. All right, recap time. So our inserts and our refractors, nothing too much, but I have to say the inserts, I really, really like. The Golden Degeneration and Heroes of Tomorrow are um, definitely very, very good. I will give tops that. And as for our quote unquote hits of the box, we had three numbered cards and one autograph. Our numbered cards starting super short, well, super short print, relatively speaking for this product, Brian Lasme, Pink Wave Rookie. That one's numbered 17 of 75. Jan Thielman, this one's going to be an Aqua, numbered 34 of 275. Makoto Hasebe, Magenta, this is the most common parallel, 75 399. And the one autograph of the box, guaranteed. Wish it could have been a numbered one, but it is a rookie autograph of Nicholas Dorsch. Just the base autograph. Nothing too, too spectacular there. So I'm going to leave these cards here. So if you guys enjoyed the video, feel free to give me a thumbs up and leave a comment and I'll try to respond to everything in a timely manner. Um, hope you guys are all doing well. And uh, if you guys are going to national, hopefully I can see some of you guys there too. And without further ado, I will end this video and catch you guys next time. Peace.